Good morning, welcome uh, to our European Morning Update. It's been a very weak uh, session in Asia overnight. Uh, Shanghai down uh, 4%, Shenzhen down 4%. Um, the uh, Hong, Hang Seng having its worst day since 2015. Now down 40% from the 21 highs since the last year. It's created by 40%. Dual things, you know, Chinese regulatory crackdown on the tech space continues and it's uh, it's a real a tough one us investors pulling out it's 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 very very difficult jp morgan saying uninvestable um and then you've got the covid lockdown so the city of shenzhen has been locked down that's 17 and a half million people uh major port major access to uh to hong kong um so that is a definite factor in all this it's also been a factor in oil prices, uh, which are off again this morning, uh, down that sort of 4% type level. Um, crude oil futures hovering around $97 now. That's a bit of a that's a blow up on the Ukraine war crisis has eased. And we are now back at 97. You've got the bearish MACD crossover there um, and Brent showing similar sort of patterns indices are weaker in europe this morning uk 100 down at uh seven under 7100 um and just starting to uh really i guess consolidate in this kind of range but looking to see um there's certainly not much bit bullish momentum there uh you can see the sort of rejection of that move and again and we're now back down in this sort of region here where we were uh, last week uh, US futures also off, and we're just at the lows of the recent range. Uh, not quite on the Feb 24th lows, but uh, getting there, and that is uh, important. It does feel like you might see a crack. 4100 on the SP e mini futures there, and we're not that far from that now. Um, not a lot of data today. We've got um, PPI numbers from the US, Empire State Manufacturing Index, and ECB. President Lagarde speaks later. And there's the ZEW economic sentiment data from the US, uh, sorry, from Germany. Um, that is it for now. We'll bring you some more later.